because she's probably sending the money to her mother. Her mother? I thought her mother died. What? What are you what are you talking about? Wait, 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 wait. You know this whole head is getting kind of tired and with, with all that happening with me, I, I don't know. I could be mistaken. But I think Carmen told me that, you know. Yeah, I think Carmen told me that her mother died. Um, by the way, did you ever meet the mother? You ever went to her country? She came here? No. I never met them in person. I did speak to her father and her mother a couple of times over the phone, but never been there. You know, Sandra, she goes down there, um, you know, to visit, take care of stuff alone, take care of the house that we have over there. A house? Yeah. What house? You have a house over there? Yeah, a house that, you know, that we're building for our future. You're building a house over there? Is the house finished? Yeah, you know, we're um, we're actually looking for another piece of land. Wait, wait. <laughs> wait, wait. You're looking for more land. Are you sure that a house really exists? I mean, by the way, what's your marriage date again? Two months from now. And you thought this thing through, right? You know, I think so. I think so. If I may ask, what else have you ever done for this woman? Why do you ask that? Ah, get about it. Ain't none of my business. Come get me to the doctor, please. Uh, you okay? Come uh, on. Yeah. Let me help you out. Let me help you out. Okay, okay. okay. Keys are here. You okay? Yeah, I can make it on my own from here. Yeah, yeah, I can make it. I'm good. Good morning, Miss. Good morning, sir. How are you? Not so good today. I'm sorry to hear. May I have your ID, please? Yeah, sure. Um, um David, please. Let me get your ID there, please. Here you go, Miss. Yes, thank you. Here you go, sir. You will go in when the other patient comes out. May you have a seat, please? Yes. Thanks a lot. You're welcome. Okay. Mr. Frederick, why were you worried if I did any other things for Sandra? Ah, oh, man, David, you know, I really don't want to intrude in your no, life. No, 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 it's not intruding, I'm asking. Well, you know, it's just that some people take advantage and abuse of other people's generosity. And honestly, I think that's exactly what your girlfriend is doing to you, you know? I don't know, man. She has changed. You know, she used to treat me so nice before, but now, I don't know, man. She doesn't even want to work anymore. All she does is just stay at home and just watch TV and do nothing. You know, David, some of them are like that, eh? They like to stay home, cook, clean, watch TV, take care of their kids. Look, man, she even stopped with the cooking, too. You know, her attitude has just changed. Well, you're not married yet, and, you know, the kids are not yours. Now, don't get me wrong, I know you love the kids, eh? and I know you will want to see them occasionally, but you can always ask, right? But that girl is bad news, David, trust me. You know, some people, they'll come into your life, man, Deplete all your energy, deplete your money, leave you with a zero bank account balance. Hmm? And then it's like they lure you into this trap that you even can't resist. Hmm. Wow, that's crazy, man. Well, you know, David, it ain't crazy. The problem is that a lot of men, they think with a small brainless head instead of the big one. Small brain in his head. What are you talking about? <laughs> David, 
David. Our penis is David. We think with our penis. <laughs> okay, okay, I get it. I understand now. <laughs> well, you know, it's not too late. It's not too late. Any woman would want a guy like you. They just don't know it yet. Only when it's too late. Sorry, you may go in now. Okay. Uh, they help me out. Their legs are killing me to say, you know. Oh. All right. Okay. From there. We're going, Doc. You should listen to his advice. Call me if you change your mind. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks. Buen día, tía. Bendiciones. ¿Cómo está? Hola, sobrina. ¿Cómo está? Yo estoy bien, gracias. ¿Y, y Federico cómo sigue? Sí, Federico. Está muy, está mal, muy mal. Pero trato de cuidarlo como yo pueda. Ah, ok. ¿Y sus hijos? Los hijos. No sé ni qué pensar. No lo llaman ni lo buscan. La esposa. ¿Y esa vieja está viva todavía? Ay, no diga eso. Espérese, déjame ponerle el speaker, espérese. Tú tienes a David ahí, que te quede a ti y a tus hijos. Ay, tía, no diga eso. Ay, tía, ya, 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 por favor, no me venga con eso. Tú sabes que a nosotros nos gustan nuestros hombres machos, fuertes. Él es demasiado gentil. Yo no puedo. Sí, pero los hombres machos de nuestro país... Son violento y mujeriego. No, tía, no es eso. Es que a nosotros, a ti, tú te acostumbraste a esta vida, que te gusta esta vida de aquí, que, que no le importa, que, que todo es tan... No, 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 no. A nosotros nos gusta que nos traten, tú sabes, como macho. Tú tienes a David ahí. Quédate tranquila con él. Ya. Ay, ya, ya, tía, por favor, yo me voy. Tú no entiendes nada. Tú te acostumbraste a esta vida aburrida. Esta vida de aquí, que, que hay que nada más quedarse así ya. Ay, mujercita malagradecida. Oh. Hi, baby Gomez. The doctor wants me to continue using the natural remedies. Oh, okay. I see. These are some medication that you have to take at a natural health store. Is that okay? Yeah, sure. She did tell me. And she wants to get me off the acidic stuff, put me on more natural things. So, yes, sure. Oh, okay. Okay, okay here you go, Mr. Thank Frederick. you. And have a nice day. Thank you, sir. Well, you think about what I said, Mr. Have a nice day. Hey, morning. Excuse me. Good morning, how are you? My daughter has a fever. Is the doctor still in? Let me check. We have a patient who has a fever or so is a limit. Okay, thanks. You are lucky, you may go in. Thank you very much. No problem. Good morning. Oh, wow. I can't believe it, man. What, what's going on? What happened? You, you need to have a seat? Yeah, yeah. I need to sit. Oh, man. What's going on? Uh, uh, yeah. 
David, you know who that was? No, I have no idea who was that. That's my son, David. And the little girl with him, that's my granddaughter. So happy I get a chance to see her, you know? But he won't speak to me, man. You know, they avoid me all the time. And I love them so much, I miss them so much, you know? But, oh man, oh, you know what? I'm just tired of trying, I'm sick of trying. Let's just go, let's go, let me go get my medication. Okay. Let me go, let me go. Let's go. Thank you very much, miss, for helping me so fast. Now I can get the meds for my daughter. You are welcome. Have a nice day. Bye, little princess. Bye. By the way, the guy that just left, is he sick? Mm, I can't talk about our patients. I think you know that, right? Come on, sweetie. Yo, bro. What's up, long time no see? Hey, my brother. What's going on? Everything blessed me, boy? For sure, for sure. Yeah? But I see your father someday here, you know. He ain't looking too well, partner. He's sick? I don't know. I don't talk to this man, you know. Boy, I'm sorry to hear that, you know. Listen, I don't talk to this man because he left my mother when he was really young. As a matter of fact, I hate this man's guts. Bye. You ever sit down and talk to him about it? No, hurry. I think you should, you know. Why? Tell me why. You don't know there's three sides to each story, brother. Three? Yeah. Your mother's side, your father's side, and most of all, God's side. He knows and sees everything, bro. But I don't want you to make the mistake, bro. You understand? My parents were divorced when I was small, too. But I'm actually happy. Happy? Yes, my brother. I'm happy because I couldn't stand to hear one more quarrel or see one more fight inside the house. And the thing is, me and my father was cool. But I sit down and think, too. Maybe he had a rough childhood. That's why he didn't know how to treat us any better. You understand? We can't change the past. Eh? What happened, happened already. But we could try to make a brighter future. We can't go our old luggage to the future. No, you got to let it go, bro. Try to take my advice into consideration. Try it. Well, you, have a, you make a good point. Yes. As a matter of fact, mm -hmm. let me put it into consideration. I'll think about it. Yeah, because look at it this way, too. Your mother have her own past. You understand? You got to let it go, bro, and just forgive and try to move on forward. You feel me? And we all know that she ain't easy. I can imagine, my brother. But you know how it is, you know. Just think about what I told you. No. You understand? Listen, I have to go. But uh, we will link. Watch nothing. Cool. Stay blessed. Yes. Stay safe. Cool. Go easy, my brother. Take it easy, yeah? All right? David, hey, thanks for being there with me today, man. I really, really appreciate it, you know? Yeah, no problem, my friend. Anytime. Yeah. So, how are you feeling now? A lot better. It's good. The meds are really, really helping. That's good. And on top of that, I got to see my granddaughter. Ah, oh, yes. You know, that that's is really the a best special thing. thing for me, yes, you know? Yes, yes. And thank you for taking me to the, um, to the place. Good evening, David. Hi. Good night. Hi, my amor. Hi. How are you feeling today? Yeah, a lot better, honey. A lot, lot better. The natural meds are really helping me out. Whoa. Yes. Que bueno. Yes. Well, I have got to go and pick up the children from afternoon school. Okay. You guys have a good night, okay? Okay, David. Okay, you too. You too. All right. Have a bye good bye. night. Bye. Good night. Yes. So, come today. and tell me how your day was. Today's I was tired. Tomorrow. Yeah, I could see that yeah. in your face. But yeah, anyway. I'm really, really tired. Yeah, you're home now. And I just want you to go and take a nice hot shower and jump in the sack. Have a good, good sleep, okay? Yes, yes.
Sasha was rushing. I was rushing to get here. Sorry about a change of venue, but I was in Aries, so I decided for us to stay right here. You order drinks? Yes. I took the liberty of pre-ordering our drinks and asking for the menu. Got it quite busy. It's my girl. I hope it's my favorite. Yes, it is. They a toast to the girls' night out. Mm -hmm. I just love how they do that. As always. <laughs> So girl, how was your day? It was very productive considering this morning's event and I am feeling fine. I love your outfit. You look good, girl. Hey, thanks, Mama. You know I look good in our dress. It's true. That's true. That's true. My day was very interesting and quite productive also. By the way, you kill anyone today? <laughs> no, 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 not today. But this day ain't over yet. If you give it up, it could be possible. No, seriously, Marcella, we women <laughs> sacrifice a lot, you know. A lot we sacrifice. Girl, tell me about it. We have to bear the kids for nine months, sometimes in agony. Pain during labor, kids grow up, get ungrateful, and we have to work our butt off to take care of the household. Wow, it's not easy. It's not easy at all. Girl? We as women have evolved and we're moving on. Men got a lot of catching up to do. They'll get there eventually. Men think they all match you one thing. You know what my husband told me last night? He is the man and he stopped helping me to do house whole chores and things. Jack was used to that. You understand? We used to do everything together. Everything together. He changed indeed. I don't know. I don't know him like that. You know, talking about change, the only thing that I think of that might have gone wrong the, the last two years, I became partner with the hotel and I bought the car rental where Jack finally works. Cindy, how you mean you buy the car rental where Jack works? But the man asked me to buy it for him. So he wanted it in his name? Yes, that's what he said. Okay, so who's the owner of the company now? Girlfriend, I am. Sorry, ladies, are you ready to order? Hi, good night. Yes? Tell me, honey. Waitress, I would like half a fried chicken. Half? Yeah. And let them fry in deep oil because I love my chicken poopsie. No problem, no. A lot of fries? Yes. Ooh, and for the sauce, a lot of mayo yes. and ketchup. And if you all have any other wetty gravy thing, that's what I like. No um, problem, honey. Vegetables? No vegetables. So I think that will complete my order. What an appetite. Yes, I'll have a grilled salmon. Yes. And some steam vegetables. So no, you always with this vegetables tingy tingy. Okay, ladies. Thank you. Thank you, waitress. You're welcome. Thank yes, you. I am. And how you mean you buy the car rental where Jack works at? But I told you the man asked me to. So I bought it. That is the only thing I thought might have gone wrong for the past two years. Wait, Cindy. So basically, Jack working for you now. Are you accusing me of doing something wrong? No, girl. I just want to. You people didn't sit down and talk about this and how it won't go. Cindy, maybe Jack wanted you to buy the company in his name. Hell no, no, no. Just... So you think, Marcella, that changed everything? It's possible men have their egos. Remember with that girl, that doesn't give Jack the right to be sleeping around with other women and a pathetic little girl younger than her own kids. Come on, man. Hmm. You know what they say. Hmm. When men have strong, powerful black women and they have one and they feel that we don't need saving, they get insecure. But when they step out there and they find these helpless, ungrateful witches that they think need saving. Then they act all like the hero for the damsel in distress. Oh, so that's why Jack told me that he's a man and not a wimp. So how do I fix this? Cindy, you want to fix this? But you don't know. No, I don't. You know why? I'm the one who keeps forgiving and forgetting. The last time I forgive and look, the same thing happened 
Only differences, a different witch. Don't blame all the witches. Because it's he who step out. It's because something is not in there. But those witches are desperate for vulnerable rich men like John. Hell no. Like you taking Jack's side now. But hush before you speak. Huh. Locking in the house. Marcella, only I knew how Jack was and the changes now. Okay, girlfriend. Let's change the topic. So Randy finishing this year, right? Oh my god, finally. <laughs> oh. Like you waited so long for this. Marcella. I can't wait for Randy to go and finish his studies. Get a job, work his butt off, and sacrifice so he can know what his mom was going through, especially with his sorry ass father. Yes, girl, I know the feeling. But remember, we were kids too, right? I know. <laughs> I know. How is Philip? And by the way, Alex, did you hear from him? I guess he's fine. No, I didn't hear from him. But Marcella, did you call the child? Cindy, I called him, but the phone rang out. Okay, maybe he's busy. Here you go, lady. Thank, Thank you. you. You're Thank welcome. You. Enjoy. He Thank will. You. Mm. Marcella, girl. Mm. This small and look good, girlfriend. I just get more hungry. Mm. Can't even take the fun. Damn, girl. You still with all those skills? You like a walking pharmacy, girl. This one for the high blood pressure, cholesterol, and remember, I have diabetes. Oh, the other one to suit my stomach after drinking all this. Don't tell me I forget it. Anyway, look, it's just a one time. When I go home, I sure will get to that girl. I need one no for Cindy. Wait, wait. You know you can get out for all of those pills if you change your diet, Miss Half Fried Chicken french fries meal but marcelo look after tonight i think i can take you up on that challenge seriously you sure it will be good for you seriously girlfriend oh my gosh enjoy mm -hmm. mm. 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 hey honey good night how was the day Okay. Did you get me the papers for my brother? <laughs> my name was Ryan, thank you very much. Okay, so did you? Yes, I did. They're on the table in the kitchen. Okay. By the way, how is your mother doing? 